Hi, I'm Wayne from Australian Earth Moving, and today I'm really excited to talk about JCB's new addition to the acclaimed X-Series, the 245XR. JCB's latest X-Series heavy line excavator, the 245XR, introduces zero tail swing technology to improve safety and efficiency for operators. The new 245XR excavator is the latest addition to JCB's highly acclaimed X-Series. And there's a key feature that differentiates the machine from the rest of the market. With an intuitive design, the 245XR offers users a reduced slewing radius, while also ensuring that other features, such as cab space, are not compromised. This is JCB's latest release on its X-Series platform. While the excavator platform weighs 20 to 25 tonnes, the weight comes in at 27 tonnes. That's with the blade. This is a reduced tail swing excavator, which is very popular and widely used in freeway construction projects. The 245XR has a tail swing radius of 1.72 metres, which is 40% less than its predecessor, the 220X excavator. This reduced tail swing provides several benefits for operators. One of the main advantages of this feature is the reduced spin, so operators don't need to close off additional freeway lanes when they're working close to live traffic. Operators can also use the machine in tight spaces when working on building and infrastructure projects. There's also a safety aspect to the reduced tail swing, as there's less chance of damage to nearby buildings or personnel on site when the machine is operation. With a 40% shorter tail swing and supported by a bucket capacity of 1.25 cubic metres, the 245XR can optimise operations in difficult working applications. The 245XR also features minor changes from the 220X. The 245XR runs on a similar hydraulic pump system as the 220X, but JCB have gone with a larger pump, a larger control valve, and better fluid dynamics throughout the whole machine. So it still maintains that speed and accuracy while also having increased breakout and performance. Creating an equilibrium. The 245XR design also has a key focus on maintaining precise and balanced movements during operation. Some of the earlier zero tail swing models were inherently unbalanced. Uh, and that's compared to, you know, as compared to standard swing excavators. But zero tail uh, machines have become a lot more balanced and a lot more controllable and just as efficient as some of the standard tail swing excavators. The JCB design team has spent a lot of time and resources developing this product, which is why it's one of the heaviest in its class and also one of the most stable. In designing the 245XR, JCB's engineers have allocated weight to key areas of the machine to achieve equilibrium. JCB are very good at producing chassis and, and putting weight in the right places. JCB machines often have heavier, lower structures and, and frames to help lower the machine's centre of gravity in order to improve the machine's stability. Even though the 245XR weighs just under 27 tonnes when equipped with a blade, JCB still manage to achieve stability on par with a 20-ton machine. But these design changes don't take away from the machine's comfort level, uh, where the operator's cabin remains at full size. JCB have retained a full size cabin, whereas some of their competitors have changed to a reduced size or a, a three quarter sized cab. At the end of the day, operators spend eight to 10 hours at a time, sometimes more, at a time in these machines, and they should feel comfortable. That's what operators can get with the new 245XR. Of course, operator feedback also contributed to the design of the 245XR's cabin, which features double cushioned viscous mounts to reduce the noise to just 69 decibels. The seat mounted joystick and switch controls, they can also move with the operator. Power and accuracy. The 245XR utilises JCB's Diesel Max engine, which was released in 2004, and has been proven to be effective in 70 different machines globally. The engine, which has a dedicated off-road design, contributes to reducing running costs for operators. 
An advanced cylinder head design means you get a more efficient burn at the head of the cylinder. The design also eliminates the need for a diesel particulate filter, which further cuts the maintenance costs. The use of AdBlue diesel exhaust fluid further adds to the engine's performance. The 245XR requires approximately 3% of AdBlue per litre of diesel, which is less than the amount required for comparable excavators. JCB has also con conducted climate testing on the 245XR components to ensure the mechanisms remain robust in temperatures between down to minus 30 degrees and up to 55 degrees Celsius. Smooth operation. Selectable swing smoothing is a feature that comes as standard with the 245XR and it enables the operator to customise the performance of the vehicle to suit any given application. This feature can produce sharper or more gradual movements depending on uh, what's required from the job at hand. Because of the additional weight of the upper revolving frame, JCB have selected a larger slew motor and larger slew brake, which helps increase the torque. Increased slew braking means operators can accurately slew left or right and then come back onto line when working on projects like installing pipes or cutting trenches. JCB also have the ability to smooth the slew where operators may want more speed instead of accuracy. They can switch to softer slew so it doesn't break as aggressively and has a smoother action. This is useful for uh, tasks such as loading trucks. The first 245XR units have already arrived in Australia and operators now have the chance to see it in action. With the unique features it offers the industry, JCB anticipate a high demand for this machine and they've got a high volume of units on their way to Australia now. For more information, visit jcbcea.com.au. I love this machine. I, I've had the privilege of seeing it in person. I know we're just showing photos here. It's an absolute beast and uh, I really appreciate you watching this video. For more of these videos, I'm going to do a, a heap more of them. And uh, if you could support the channel, uh, click the little bell, bell notification and subscribe down below. It really helps a lot. And uh, if I can build this, it enables me to get access to a lot more machines for you. And uh, something that, you know, I'm a bit of a, a machine nerd and geek out on. So thanks so much for supporting the channel. See you soon.